Well, hundreds of soldiers are working to achieve the expert soldier badge. It's a highly sought after symbol of excellence that only the best will earn. Six News reporter Barry Roy brings us the story of one soldier looking to be the next. Then you go fire hold, charge again, fire. Today is a day to get better for First Lieutenant Thomas LaRose. And I took the mag out and then I went, I cleared it. To be an expert soldier just like a long line of those who came before him. Going back to great grandfather, fought World War II, 101st. Both grandfathers, uh, Navy and Marine Corps respectively. In the early morning chill, Thomas is in the final hours of training for the expert soldier badge. A badge designed to improve lethality and recognize excellence in soldier combat skills through a series of 33 disciplines. It proves that you're an expert, well-rounded as a soldier in all these events. For a soldier to earn the ESB badge, one must master physical fitness, marksmanship, and land navigation while demonstrating and perfecting what it means to be a soldier. What's happening behind me right now is hands-on training, practice to earn this badge. It's all about repetition. It's all about hands-on. It's all about being the best of the best. Nearly 300 soldiers are vying for the badge, but only a dozen or so may achieve it. It's only a failure if you take it that way, accept it. An opportunity to grow is what Thomas is after, a chance to be mentioned among the best to ever do it, as he continues a family lineage rich in military history of sacrifice and honor. Oh, I'm, I'm ready, fired up, ready to go. At Fort Hood, Barry Roy, 6 News. And the final test will take place over the course of the next five days. Thomas says if he doesn't achieve his expert soldier badge, he will train harder for the next time. We wish you the best luck.